Hello, today I want to talk about curves and levels because between them both there's not much difference at all and I'll show you what I mean by that. To start off with I'm going to go to the adjustments and I'm going to open up levels and I'm also going to open up curves. We'll start off on levels, we're going to flick between them both. At, at the top of levels you've got your black levels if you move your black levels across it works as like a file and you're compressing everything together so as you keep going you start turning everything black all the way across and if we go to curves and grab the bottom dot and move everything across the bottom line it does the exact same as levels, it starts making everything completely black. And it's the same with the white, come from white from that to that end, it makes everything white, almost everything, shall I say. And levels, we go to the white levels and doing the same, it does everything there. The same as curves. We'll come back to the gamma shortly. I'm going to skip that for now. We've got in the blackout, the black levels, the output black levels, and move it across. It puts highlights into the shadows, and the output white levels puts shadows into the highlights. And curves does the exact same. If we come down, it puts shadows into the highlights. And if we come up from the bottom, it puts highlights into the shadows. At this point, you're thinking, well, they're both the same. Why have them both? And they are almost the same. If we go back to levels, what I was meaning by this is the gamma, if you move it across, think of these as your mid-tones. You put in shadows into your mid-tones. And if you come... The opposite way, you're putting the highlights into your mid-tones. And the same with the curves. If you put a dot here and move it down, you're putting highlights into your mid-tones. Um, sorry, you're putting shadows into your mid-tones. And if you move up, you're putting highlights in. And you're still thinking, well, they're just the same. And right now, they are. The difference is with these, you get more control over your curves if we reset that and we change and put the dot here we're now affecting the colors here and we can move it up if we put another dot there because now it's calculating from that that dot to that dot so we're only changing the colors here with a slight bit on this line so these colors here we'll just put in some highlights where if you do it on levels, you can't target these colours here. Because if you come here, it's put highlights in the whole of that area. And that's the difference between curves and levels. Curves gives you much more control. The thing is with curves, I would never go past more than three dots. Because if you put another one here and put... Some highlights there and then you remove that dot down put highlights here and put that one there and then put another one here fetch that down you can start to end up looking like it's had patch patchwork done and it doesn't look great and then add one here it starts changing it all and you can see if I grab the lasso tool round here in certain places it starts to look real patchy you can't really see it that's why I would never go more than three and that's the only difference between them both they can both do the same thing but curves gives you that little bit more control and I'll say it comes down to you yourself when you want to design something or change a photograph it comes down to using whichever one you prefer if you had to learn either one i would learn curves but 
levels is good for photo correction like my last video so I'll leave it down to you to decide which ones which one you think is best between curves and levels where me I, I do like them both for different tasks and I'm gonna leave the video there it was just a quick talk about curves and levels if if you've enjoyed it please give it a thumbs up if you've not subscribed please do subscribe and hit hit the bell for our next notification for when we next upload and I am going to start to try and stick to Mondays at lunchtime and Fridays at lunchtime so I do upload twice a week thank you for watching and I'll see you next time